gentleman may proceed. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. It is my distinct honor and pleasure to introduce to the House today Jordan Fairman, a resident of Dubois, the daughter of Rod and Leslie Fairman over here. Rod is a uh, police officer in uh, Sandy Township, and uh, uh, the Fairman family is also a local farming family uh, in our community. And uh, I'm here to uh, I am here to present this citation to Jordan Fairman, who is our two-time National Arm Wrestling USA champion in the lightweight division. Uh, Arm wrestling has been described by the national president and founder of the organization as an event that is 40-40-20. 40% 40, 40, 20. 40 strength, 40% technique, and then 20% guts. Who wants it the most? And in this case, uh, I am proud to announce that for two times running, Jordan Fairman has earned the national title, uh, culminating a 32-0 record with her final uh, victory most recently in Phoenix, Arizona. And I'd like to present uh, this citation just read an excerpt from it. Whereas for the second consecutive year, Ms. Fairman remains undefeated in the women's lightweight class, compiling a record of 30 wins and zero losses. She competed in four matches against competitors in her division and defeated all of her opponents. Ms. Fairman started competing in the arm wrestling events in August 2010 and has competed in numerous events throughout the past two years. In 2010, she was named the Arm Wrestling National USA Champion and she was ranked number one in the United States in women's arm wrestling. Ms. Fairman is truly deserving of recognition and praise for utilizing her exceptional ability with diligence and for her tenacious pursuit of athletic excellence. Now, therefore, the House of Representatives of the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania extends hearty congratulations to Jordan Fairman upon her most noteworthy achievement, acknowledges her investment of skill and effort in competing on a level which demands perfection, offers best wishes for continued success in all future endeavors. So I would like to ask my colleagues to please join me in congratulating Ms. Jordan Fairman.